What's up guys, Totally Dubbed here. Today I'm going to be flashing Ginger Reel, made by Muay Thai Fighter 8 and Red Mana. So I got a request by Muay Thai Fighter to uh, make him a video and um, I thought, well why not? It looks like a good ROM, it looks good looking, so <laughs> looks stable as well, so why not? So um, first of all, I just want to show you that I'm on Darkies 10.1 Lite by Serico with Dark Core 2.5. I know 2.6 is out already, but um, I haven't flashed that over yet. So first of all, what we want to do is go into um, recovery. This is as explained uh, by Muay Thai Fighter on um, his XDA thread. He's got it installed installation um, step-by-step guide um, however well I'm making a video for it anyway so what we're going to do is um, we're going to wipe the data uh, slash fa factory reset and we're going to wipe the cache um, and the Dalvik cache as well um, this is just to make sure that you've got absolutely no problems later on after you have um, after you have uh, flashed a ROM so it's just to be on the safe side. You don't have to do this because I haven't really done it for any other ROM, but um, you can um, you can do as he says or um, go your own way. So I'm just doing it by the books, shall I say? So what we do is uh, wipe the data. As you can see, it just takes a little bit of time, but uh, once that's done, it's wipe the cache anyway. But we'll do it there. Remember, you will um, lose any data that you've got, as you can see. Uh, that's why I'm. This is what I'm doing right now. And there we go. And now what we're going to do is basically um, turn off the phone. So we're going to go out and power off. Um, I did it that way, but you can also pull out the battery. Um, that's what's said in Muay Thai Fighters um, guide. So it's up to you. Next thing we want to do is um, go into uh, download mode, so we want to go down and power key. There you go, now we're into download mode. Now I'm going to attach the USB which is connected to my computer. And I'm going to take you back up over here. And right, so here I've got two Odins open, 1.7 and 1.3. I've got it open just in case people have problems with 1.7. As you can see, the Samsung Galaxy S has been added in. Um, and I wanted to show you, because this is a common mistake, and I've, I've done it once already. When you select the PIT file, it goes to the one that is last done. So in this case, I've got Darkies Resurrection 10.1. Um, so make sure you go to the right folder. Uh, double check each time. So I've put it on the desktop. Um, and my mouse has just died, there we go. Go into the base pack and choose the PIT. Uh, I just forgot to say that when you do download um, the file on the XDA thread, uh, you will download the Odin um, flashable, which will look like this. And you'll have um, the .tar.m um, D5 file and the .pit file and you'll have Odin 1.7 in there. So this is the Odin 1.7 and as soon as you add a PIT file you'll notice that repartition gets ticked automatically and that's what we want so we leave it ticked. PDA as you can see bang ginger reel gorilla base pack make sure it's that yes that's right. So now on 1.3 the reason I've got 1.3 open is because when I select a PIT file um, it does not automatically add the repartition. There you go. So you want to tick that. So if you're on 1.3 for some reason, um, although 1.7 is included, and you have problem with 1.7, you can easily try 1.3. For example, uh, Vista users had problems, so they use that. So as you can see, now it's added the PIT and the PDA file. I've ticked repartition. It's in there by the, Sa the Samsung Galaxy S, and it's plugged. Next thing you want to do is hit start. Now, this might take a little bit of while, so I'll get back to you guys after this is done. Right, 2 minutes and 52 seconds later, uh, my phone is finished, and you'll get into recovery. As soon as it gets into recovery, you just want to reboot system now by hitting the power button. So it's as simple as that, and now we'll just wait and see how long this takes as well. And so there is the, uh, the boot animation. Uh, this happens after you get the uh, voodoo uh, voice coming on and the voodoo voice saying it is being enabled. Right, so once that's done, unplug it. You can unplug it after um, Odin's finished as well, so once you're in recovery, I always choose to do it then. So all we have to do now is just go um, through 
setup. Right, so um, now I can choose between the launchers, TW launcher and launcher, so I'll just go for launcher. Ginger reel, there we go. So if, let's try the uh, TW launcher. They're both different, obviously you can choose what you want. And um, it looks very nice, uh, my initial impression is very nice indeed. So um, I'm just going to show you what um, I'm on. Over scroll effect is green. About phone, um, the modem is JVO. Um, and we're in G Ginger Reel 5.0. So now I'm going to be flashing over um, Ginger Reel 5.1 as well. So uh, before I do this, uh, you don't have to do this at all. Um, I'm just going to format uh, the USB. So the internal SD, in other words, um, simply because I don't really, um, I don't really need anything on there. So I might as well keep it clean. Um, let's just stick to the gingerbread launcher. Very nice, very smooth, very very smooth indeed. So um, so now we're going to um, we're going to uh, at attach the uh, cable back into the computer, and we can close Odin. That is. USB connected, select files, there we go, um, and once that's done you'll get your internal SD, remember you might have loads of more stuff in there but um, I don't really need them so what's the point, um, and so I have got Ginger um, Real 5.0 which is the, the one which is already inside, so in case I want to go back. Uh, to it, I've got Ginger Reel 5.1, and I've also got a um, gold, um, goldish theme as well. So um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try them all out, and I'm gonna show you, um, show you that. Right. So once that's done, we can uh, disconnect. I'm going to uh, show you my, uh, my files. Tunnel ST. As you can see, those three files are in there. And um, just one more thing I'm going to do is I'm going to sign into uh, the market. Right, the reason I just signed into my Google account is just so I can get the uh, green icons, so the green Wi-Fi there. So uh, now we're just going to go into um, recovery. We're after just a little bit of a wait. Um, first of all, as you can see, you can go into Voodoo Lag Fix, and it's been enabled uh, when I told you that it was making those noises. <laughs> Um, and got advanced reboot into download mode right there restart ADBD that's that's pretty cool uh, key test report error Dalvik and yeah that's pretty cool um, so I'm going to install zip from SD card choose zip from SD card and I'm going to go for ginger reel 5.1 so that's the latest one as of um, the 6th of June some people did not like the, the 5.1 version but um, I'm up, I'm up for trying anything to be honest, so I don't really mind. <laughs> right, so once that's done, I'm going to go back and reboot system now. And there you go, you can see the, uh, the Samsung boots again. And there we go, I'm on uh, Ginger Reel 5.1. Apparently some people did not like the animations, so um, let's just try and see what the animations are. That's pretty cool, that uh, switching animation right there. I actually quite like that. It's quite nice. Let's go to display. Let's get rid of automatic brightness. Let's go all animations. <laughs> That's really cool. I really like that. Haha. <laughs> Very nice, very nice, very fast as well, very, very, very fast, very impressed. So we've got Asgard version unknown, um, that sometimes pops up, so forget that. Build uh, number Ginger Reel 5.1. So there we go, and again, the modems at JVO, which can easily be changed. Right, so I hope you've enjoyed that, guys. Uh, please do rate, uh, comment, and subscribe, and uh, give, your, give your thanks uh, to Muay Thai Fighter 8 and uh, Red Mana on um, XDA. See you guys. Bye bye.